Hello everyone, today we are having new video review and as you can see this time we are going to check fresh release from Serotina. This model is named as a DS1 Powermatic 80 and we had a chance to play with it for several days so here are our impressions. First of all I have to say that uh, we reviewed the DS1 big date before but it was a special edition commemorating 60 years anniversary and now we have let's say a more accessible model which should be cheaper but still it houses uh, the same movement inside and it is finished in a classic design. There will be several versions produced, as you can see we had the silver dialed version with the mesh strap. But as I said, there will be 8 models in total, so definitely you'll find something suitable for yourself. The S1 Powermatic comes in a polished case, and as you can see, it looks sleek because the size is relatively small, it is 40mm only, and combined together with Milani's strap, it fits on the wrist nicely and it is really comfortable to use. We have quite interesting dial finish here, because whole dial is finished in silver color, we have silver indices as well, but note the color of the handset. All three hands come in a bluish finish and looks really great in person because it features this gloss coating which plays on the light. And of course the dial itself features grooves which are typical for sunray finish, so they also shine under the bright light. At 3 hours mark you'll find a date window, note that it is finished in white color. All logos are reduced to the possible minimum and they look really sleek here so they don't jump all out of the overall composition. So that's really great, I appreciate that Certina decided not to go into extremes here. All these parts combined create an image of the classic watch and that's what was actually planned to achieve by Certina. Because whole DS1 Powermatic line is a celebration of their retro timepieces which were produced in 1960s. There are no extra complications, so we have one crown here, no any push buttons. And crown is quite easy to operate, so I really doubt that you'll find any possible issues here. On the crown you'll find Certino logo, which looks neat and comes in polished finish. As for the bracelet, we have here a mesh, it's a stainless steel 316L, so it should be quite durable, as you can see it comes in polished finish. So combined together with polished case, it looks really sleek and just like it was meant to be. Nevertheless, if you are not a fan of the metal bracelet, Certina gives you the extra strap. It's a brown weather option, as you can see we didn't shoot it on the video, but there is a photo in the video description below, we have a full review article there. So you will have an option out of the box between two strap options. Of course nobody stops you from placing this watch on some NATO strap, because it will look sleek on this type of the strap as well. As for the mesh bracelet, it is approximately the same system as what we saw on the S1 Big Date, so we have special inserts in the buckle area, which should make it easier to adjust whole strap. Jokes aside, this bracelet is really comfortable to wear, especially if you have the heavy wrist. It is a common problem with such bracelets. Here I did not experience any issues, so I think it will be okay. Now we can move on to the movement in this watch. It is the same as what we saw in the S1 Big Date. So it's a Powermatic 80 and the number actually hints on the power reserve in this watch. This is quite innovative movement and there are few alternatives in the same price range which can offer the same power reserve and the same innovation out of the box. Moreover, it is a Swiss made movement which adds a bonus point for this watch. You can see the movement through the clear case back which is really cool and I really recommend to check photos as well, we have them in our review article which I mentioned before. So watch is not that big, it is easy to wear on average sized men's wrist. We have here really basic water protection, so this is definitely not a diverse watch. Protection equals to 100 meters, so it should be more than enough for splashes, maybe for light rain, but definitely not for diving. And I really wonder who will be actually planning to dive with such beautiful watch. Dial is easily readable in every conditions, even though there is no luminous covering 
on the dials or handset, so you won't be able to see anything in the dark. But I think that's not a huge issue for the dress watch just like this one. New Serutina DS1 Powermatic 80 should be already available in all good watch shops. For example, you can find it in Helvetia. link will be in the video description below. As far as I know, price is set at 700 US dollars, which makes it really attractive option for your watch collection. In my opinion, it might be also a good choice for one watch collection, because some of us don't want to have a huge array of watches. So here is the one which might satisfy your needs. We have really great build quality, quite innovative and unusual movement inside with really impressive power reserve and all this comes for a really reasonable price tag. Of course I will be happy to hear your opinion about this watch, don't forget to write it in the comment section below, I will be happy to discuss it with you. If you like this video and you want to support us, press the like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you won't miss any new video reviews. And I will see you in the next video review as usual. Thank you for watching and bye!